Pamela Burroughs and these are the day's top stories. The suspect who implicated former Devolution Cabinet Secretary Anwai Guru in the 791 million shilling National Youth Service scam was on Monday questioned by Ethics and Anti-Corruption Commission detectives. The suspect, Josephine Kabura, arrived at the EACC Integrity Center offices on Tuesday morning after missing her initial appointment due to ill health. The EACC detectives have reopened investigations into the scam, for which there are already those who have been charged. In the said Afi David, Kavura casts doubt on the initial investigations and on the role Waiguru and others played. Inspector General of Police Joseph Boynet has ordered the immediate arrest and prosecution of a pilot seen on video assaulting a policewoman in Nyandarwa. The IG says the foreign pilot is required to surrender to the nearest police station as part of investigations into the incident that has outraged Kenyans on social media. The issue is already trending under the hashtag deport Rutus pilot after the video went viral. In the video, the pilot is seen emerging from the helicopter after a crowd of children surged towards it before shouting insults at the policewoman and then grabbing her swagger stick. At some point in the video, he's seen pushing the policewoman as the crowd watches in disbelief. President Kenyatta is in Israel for a three-day state visit aimed at expanding trade, investment and security ties between Kenya and Israel. During the visit, President Kenyatta will hold bilateral meetings with Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu and President Ruben Rivlin. President Kenyatta's visit is expected to increase the levels of cooperation between Kenya and Israel on security issues, including the crucial area of intelligence sharing to deal with emerging threats. For more on these and other stories, subscribe to our YouTube channel, Capital FM Kenya.